Yo dudes, what's up? This is Planet Keith, I'm Keith, and today I'm going to be talking about painting again. A couple of weeks ago I released a video on um, me actually doing my first painting for many, 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 many years. And uh, since then I've done quite a few more, so I'm just going to show you those. Can you let me know what you think? Um, I'm not proud. <laughs> I, I think some of them have merit, um, but... I'm still searching for a style, searching for subject matter. You know, I'm I'm not good with people and animals. I'm better with straight lines and buildings. And also, I, th I guess because of my technical design background, I, I I can't I can't bring myself to draw something incorrectly. You know, I I love some styles of you know naive painting. Um, primitive kind of painting but you know I, I cannot break the laws of perspective to save my life I just can't and so I think and it, and it, whatever I do it's it's going to be well drafted it's going to be pretty accurate maybe I should try some things that aren't drawn properly properly because <laughs> you know you look at Picasso and you think that guy couldn't draw he could really, but um, he went beyond that to get to the essence of what he was drawing. And that's not something I'm able to do right now. Uh, anyway, we'll see what happens. So this uh, canal scene is on the Leeds Liverpool Canal at a place called Newley, or Newley um, which is about, I don't know, five, six miles from Leeds. Quite close to us, so... <laughs> I'm down there quite a lot. Uh, I chose this because I like painting water and uh, I like boats. I like the, you know, the, the sinuous curves that you get with a boat. And unusually for this part of the world, the sun was shining and those reflections, you know, they, they look fake, but they are, they are pretty much what they really look like. So I'm quite pleased with it, but I thought it was a little bit lifeless. Well, completely lifeless until I put this bloke in and uh, yeah I made him up from you know what I imagine a fisherman would look like or an angler and uh, yeah he's um, he's a bit terrible really and he's got the world's shortest fishing rod you know it should, should sort of go out to the middle of the canal but yeah right so I uh, yeah. moving on uh, this is um, actually the same place, same bridge, from the other side. Obviously, not the same sunny day. This was in the deep midwinter when, you know, it really was, there was a lot of snow and this part of the canal was actually frozen over. Uh, so, yeah, those, those boats aren't going anywhere. And what I was trying to do in here, in this, was, uh, I, I remember from art classes at school when one of my we had to paint a snow scene and the teacher said uh, snow is not white by the way uh, I said of course it is and he says it isn't look closely and he's right you know it's it's very pale shades yellows and blues and purples and greens um, so I do actually feel quite cold <laughs> looking at this I'm quite pleased with the, the the treatment of the water and and of the snow. This these decorative spirals that I keep coming back to, I think that's quite effective. And yeah, I was going to say, I usually work from photographs. Uh, this one I didn't. I worked from well imagination because really there's no kind of fish that looks like this. But it's, I was trying. I'm trying to find style I'm trying to find a subject matter and uh, you know I, I, I do like the way I've done the water these you know wavy lines of different colors and with transparency the fish isn't quite what I wanted I've seen paintings of fish that have iridescent scales and it's just amazing but um, yeah this fish hasn't got them Oh, and then, <laughs> oh dear, right, this one is an absolute stinker. Ugh. 
I've got these photos of St Paul's Cathedral in London and the Millennium Bridge. What I haven't got is this photo, this exact viewpoint looking straight on. So uh, I, I tried to work it from what I got, which turned out to be it was a horrible, horrible job. Um, and the bridge, it's a spectacular structure, it, but it's very hard to understand what's going on with this bridge. It's actually a suspension bridge, but at its thickest point, it's only 2.4 meters, which is, you know, from the top of these piers or columns um, to the underside of the decking. So it's really, really slender and it's really a bizarre, I think, uh, construction. It was uh, an overcast day, but the, suddenly the sun came out and the cathedral was you know, illuminated in this, this bright sunlight and it looked fantastic. So I was trying to recreate that and failed miserably. So yeah, I gave up. But then I had another go. And so I actually used the viewpoint pretty much of a real photograph that I had. Um, and this, this, by the way, is, uh, in the photograph is Mrs. Planet and Son of Planet. Um, <laughs> but it, it, that's quite a good likeness of him. It's nothing like Mrs. Planet, but anyway. Again, understanding a bit more about how the structure works. I've still got it wrong. This, this is too high, or it should be further over, so these come in lower. But I do like the cathedral with wiggly outlines, hand-drawn, wiggly outlines and then the modern buildings are drawn with razor sharp with a ruler kind of thing and also people people are really not my forte at the moment but um, but I stuck a load in and some of them I quite like I quite like this bloke I like his beard and uh, yeah so there you go that's my gigantic art collection up till now I will keep on. Um, I've just got to sign this one because I reckon it's finished and cut it off the board and stretch the next bit of paper for the next piece of art. So if you enjoy this, give it a like, share, subscribe, etc. And thanks for watching and see you next time.